Theodore Roosevelt I love a cuddly teddy bear, and I just discovered something. Teddy bears are named after the 26th President of the United States, Theodore Roosevelt, who some people called Teddy. Theodore Roosevelt was the youngest man ever to become president. When he moved into the White House, so did his family, including his six children, two girls and four boys. The oldest was 16, the youngest three. Roosevelt's White House was a lively place. His children romped about the lawns and house. He entertained many people, including cowboys, explorers, writers, and artists. And the family had lots of animals. What do dogs, cats, parrots, an owl, a rooster, a hen, rabbits, snakes, a lizard, a badger, guinea pigs, many horses, and a small bear have in common? They all lived at the White House when Roosevelt was president. It is not surprising that President Roosevelt liked having so many animals around. Even as a child, Roosevelt loved wildlife and loved learning as much as he could about nature and animals. When he was eight years old, Roosevelt turned his bedroom into a self-made museum and called it the Roosevelt Museum of Natural History. He filled it with birds' nests, tadpoles, and insects. All his life, Roosevelt loved bird watching. He was nearsighted, though, meaning he couldn't easily see faraway things. That didn't stop him. Before he got eyeglasses, he mastered identifying birds by their sounds. Roosevelt's father also loved nature. He was the founder of the American Museum of Natural History in New York City. Roosevelt helped too. Starting as a teenager, he gave some of his wildlife collection to the museum. Can you guess what was important to Theodore Roosevelt once he became president? He wanted to conserve or protect the American wilderness and its natural resources, like animals, forests, and streams. During his presidency, Roosevelt designated or named 18 national monuments, including the Grand Canyon. He also created five national parks, 150 national forests, and 51 bird reservations. Say bravo for bird watching! Roosevelt's actions led to the protection of 230 million acres of American land. That's more land than the entire state of Texas. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of land. Calling all nature lovers! If you visit the American Museum of Natural History in New York City, you can sit alongside a life-size statue of Theodore Roosevelt. Maybe you should visit with a teddy bear in hand. Three cheers for Theodore Roosevelt! I have an important job for you. Which stuffed animal is named for Theodore Roosevelt? The teddy bear is named for Theodore Roosevelt. Which animal did not live at the White House when Roosevelt was president? Elephants did not live at the White House when Roosevelt was president. What did Theodore Roosevelt help protect? Theodore Roosevelt helped protect forests. 
How do you know that Theodore Roosevelt loved nature? Tap the green button to record. I, I loved the how, um, uh, I liked the forest. Skipper Dee Dee, you learned so much today. Let's share your ideas. Coo Coo, I have some fun for you. Teddy bears are named for Teddy Roosevelt. I'd love to see your drawing of a teddy bear. Eraser. Paint roller. Pencil. Brush. <laughs> 